Hello and welcome back to the channel, guys. My name is London. I'm back with you to do the daily tarot reading for Saturday, January 3rd, 2015. I picked three cards from the Vanessa Tarot, which is a cute little fun tarot deck that I use right here. And I have an Angel Tarot card from Doreen Virtue to get a description of the um, energies of today that we can expect. And I have two um, Mermaids and Dolphins cards that fell out of the deck for messages from our guides and um, angels for what we can expect for to this day. So we're going to go ahead and get started. And the first card that we have from Vanessa Tarot is... The Ten of Wands. And as you can see, the Ten of Wands really depicts this college student. She has her glasses on. She has all these different books with bookmarks and sticky notes hanging out of it. And she's focused and she's getting down to work. So it's really showing that maybe this woman has um, let all of these different tasks in her life build up. And now she's taking the time to really just focus on those tasks and get those things done now maybe she has some delays or something with um, getting these um, you know these projects done that she was trying to work on but whatever it is it's really telling is really showing that she's having to really focus all of her energy on the things that she's trying to get done the ten of wands is a transition card it's um, and the tens are all about transition, but really what this woman is doing, she's being responsible. She's taking on all of her duties that she needs to get done at the present moment, and she's going after it. She's getting those things done that she needs to get done, so that's really good. It looks like we're focused and we're getting things done that we need to get taken care of. Next card from Vanessa Tarot is the Chariot card, which is a major arcana card. And I love this card. Look how nice she looks. She has her little scarf over her head. She has her big sunglasses and she's driving her convertible. And she has all these different things stacked up in her um her trunk <laughs> and um she's moving fast she's moving in a direction that she wants to go and she may have had some obstacles in the background but she's really moving to towards where she wants to go she's determined she's confident she's strong-willed she's decisive she's goal-oriented and she knows what she wants and she's going after it so that's what is letting us know this person is really the reading right now is really showing that you know we have a lot of things that are on our plate right now that we're studying we're observing we're trying to work on them and get them to a completion point maybe these are things that we have intended to that have um, built have built up in our um, in our lives but it's really letting us know that we're we're taking the time to um, do the work that's needed and because we're taking the time to do the hard work that's needed and really um, you know, paying attention and focusing so much on this, these different projects that we're trying to create. It's letting us know that, you know, we're, we're going to be moving forward and we're going to um, be feeling a lot more confident once we get these things done. So it's really telling you to continue to work and continue to do the things that you need to do to, um, to really, um, get where you need to be because you're really moving forward right now. You're, um, it's telling you to be confident and to be strong-willed and be decisive. Make those plans that you need to make and deal with those things that you need to deal with once and for all so you can get to where you need to be because you need to move forward. The next card that we have from Vanessa Tarot is the Ace of Swords in Reverse. And we're just going to take a look at the Ace of Swords upright because I don't think we've had this card from this deck. But the Ace of Swords in this card depicts, I guess she's the angel, but um, she's on a cloud. And she's um, presenting you with a sword. And a sword is all about clarity and like, um, you know, clarity mental thinking, you know, it's just really just, she's presenting you with clarity of the mind, basically. And it's, it's, it's creating, like, this potential clarity is, like, a, it's potential for you to have a personal victory. As you can see, like, the clarity of this mind is being held up and it's replacing the sun. So, it's really letting you know that this particular thought that you have, it, um, 
could lead to a personal victory for you. But this is really in the Ace of Swords is all about serious thinking and responsibility um, in its own. But with this in reverse, it's really letting you know that you may be unclear about um, your personal victory that you're having right now in your life. You may be unclear as how to move forward, how to get to the place that you need to be, how to tap into... Um, this chariot energy where you're moving forward with um, your projects. You have all of your um, things that you needed in hand and you're moving forward in a direction that you want to go. It's really telling you to take that time to study the situation, create those goals, um, really put your head in the books and focus on this, um, this situation to get it completed. So let's just wrap up the reading. It's really telling us that we need to study and focus on the things that we're doing. Um, to get to where we need to be. Take the time to focus and um, get things done that maybe you've been pushing off. But it's really telling you to, um, you know, make a checklist if you have to and really go by one by one as to um, each and every obstacle that you have and get them done one by one because you are strong enough to move forward. You're confident enough. You have your goal in mind and you can move forward with this. There may be a little bit of uncertainty, but know that once you continue to do the work that things will fall into place because this has um, this could be a per personal victory for you. The, the, the clarity, the, when you get clarity around this situation, when you keep working and moving forward, in this situation, you're going to get a, some clarity and that clarity is going to lead to a personal victory in your life because this, this sword is um, replacing the sun. So um, know that this is going to be a personal victory once you get that type of clarity in mind. So really think about the things that you want to create and where you're going and then move after them. Go after those things and then the tensions and the worries and the stresses that you have will fall away. Next card up from Angel Tarot is the Renewal card with Archangel Jermiel. And it says, Review and evaluate a, fi a favorable assessment of the facts and time to move in a direction. This is basically just letting you know what I just said. It's, te it's telling you to take the time to review and evaluate the circumstances that you're um, working on right now. Um, decide what direction that you want to move in and then move in that direction. Take all of the obstacles that you've been dealing with with take all of the knowledge that you have acquired with this situation even though you may be feeling a little bit of uncertainty with it feel the uncertainty and still move forward anyway because it's going to be a personal victory and these and the angels are leading you to this personal victory and they're telling you to just take time to um, think about where you want to go because you can create what you want to create it's just a matter of um, focusing in on it and being confident in yourself and just pursuing that goal. Next card up, well, we'll just show these two. We have have faith and it says your prayers are manifesting. Remain positive and, uh, and follow your guidance. So this is letting you know that you know what to do already and that's basically to continue working and um, be confident in where you're trying to go because you're moving into um, you know a phase of your life that is going to be so much brighter for you but it's, it's telling you to really just have that faith because you're able to manifest everything that you um that you want and continue to um, follow the angel's lead, basically. Next card up is set your sights higher. And it says increase your standards and expect more for yourself. Don't settle. So it's really telling you, like, if the things that you are working on right now, you need to be confident in those things. You know, you may feel as if you don't really have clear because you don't have clarity around the situation. It's really making you feel confused as to um, what you should do. But the angel's guidance for today is to really increase your standards. Don't settle if you're thinking about settling in this particular situation. Continue to do the work that's necessary and you're going to move forward and you're going to have that breakthrough so just um move forward with the things that you're trying to create and know that things are going to work out great all right guys so these are the messages that i have for saturday just keep on moving forward and keep on doing the work the the um the mental clarity will come 
just continue to work and continue to move forward and have that faith. The clarity will come. The road will um, make itself available to you. Just keep pushing forward. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll be back with you again tomorrow. Bye-bye.